Welcome back to the original Fallout. Um, we just finished going through the cathedral, killed all the children of the cathedral people, killed a bunch of super mutants down here, and the master's pets. Uh, we're about to go into this vault, and we're about to rumble with all the rest of the super mutants and everybody else. And I thought there were some more guarding this door, but I guess... Oh, I guess I took those guys out. Um, I thought there were more people, though. That I was gonna have to deal with. Did I already come in here and mess with this stuff? No, because this locker's closed still. Never mind. Um, see computer. We always try to science with the computers, of course. Fail to learn anything. All right, it's a useless one. It's locked. Okay. So we're gonna have to skills lock pick it because skills lock pick it because we need to get everything open. Come on. Seems like all of my skills went down some percentages. Oh well. Let's keep going. I wonder if maybe I lost some equipment. There we go. We deftly picked, picked the lock, apparently. Thought it said you definitely picked the lock, so it's like... Yeah, you totally did that, man. You picked that lock. Yeah. Uh-huh. Uh, I see a computer... Oh. For a moment, but cannot get past... Oh, wait, what? You see some pieces that might be human flesh. That's not good. You fiddle with this computer because you can't get past the security system. I took some damage for some reason. Do I just have some brain damage from a previous fight? Oh, look. 1,250 experience for hacking into this machine. I like that. We're messing with this human flesh. Um, wait. Did I not get past the security systems? thought I did. You find the interesting data with a secret base to the northwest on file. You find some interesting data file on a secret base to the northwest, which we already took care of. Right? That sounds like the base we already blew up. Ah, well. We got some experience out of it. Down to floor two. Oh, gosh. There's human flesh all over this place. This is disgusting. Where's their cleaning lady? Or person or man? Mad scientist, he's working diligently on something. Well, these aren't janitors like I thought they were. You see a sleeping mad scientist. So he's like standing up sleeping? Or what? Oh well, time to free this mad scientist. These mad scientists. This is disgusting. I hate everything about this place. <laughs> Intruders instantly, critical hit, nailed me and killed me. Alright. Those criticals, though. Hey. They're brutal. They always seem to get me when I'm least expecting it. Alright. Time to science this computer. Should I... Nah. Yeah, meh. Yeah, I'm not gonna bother. For hacking into this computer. Oh, okay. We. This is where we found that file. I thought it was um, some sort of security thing. I seriously don't know what's going on here. With my random losing of HP. Maybe it's just a feature of down here. Maybe we're slowly being turned into a super mutant. That'd be fun. Could be Babe Ruth as a super mutant. All right, we're gonna try a different access, different angle for this. Is what I meant to say. We're gonna sneak, and then we're going to put a freaking stem pack in our, our super stem pack in our hands. Is that actually useful? Because I can just get to my inventory and use them. Uh, well, yeah, I guess it's useful because we can attack also. And then we're going to pull out our... S what is this thing called? Super Sledge. I almost called it a sword. We're going to Super Sledge the heck out of this guy's head. Never saw it coming. Oh, now he's angry. There's two guys up here. The mad scientists want to punch us. Hopefully he's not going to critical me and kill me. Oh my gosh, he does so much damage. I would like a turn, please. Thank you. Hit me in the groin. Ah, shoot. <laughs> well, I'm never having kids. Guess it doesn't really matter because we haven't even found a, a suitable mate for Babe Ruth and he's about to die. Come on, guy. Vincent. He's a named character, apparently. <laughs> I'm going to smack you around. I'm sure you are, buddy. 20 hit points. All right. We've got a stim up. Hopefully we don't accidentally use this on one of the mad scientists. Shoot. That, uh... Left us without the ability to attack. 
I thought he... Hmm. Dang. I guess super stim packs take more. Jeez. These guys are so punchy. 20 damage, 18. Hmm. It's a little bit better. Not too bad. Hit him in the head. I think something is wrong with Babe. Babe Ruth. Because he's doing less damage. He's having a harder time hitting. He's randomly taking damage. Just doesn't make a whole lot of sense. Maybe he got shot in the head. Maybe he has... I don't know. Some sort of disease. Fine. No, he's still not dead. Oh my gosh, this guy. Die, Vincent. Now he's dead. But now we have... Uh, his friend over here. Minigun man. Let's see if I can hit him from over here. Nope, need to be closer. Okay. So we're gonna hit him with a five thrust straight in the groin. And is he dead? He's flown quite a distance. Yeah, no, is he not dead? He just knocked the giant to the ground. Oh come on. <laughs> no, he's getting back up. What is wrong with this? Why is this a there we go. I'm not even paying attention to these guys. Just worrying about the big man. Straight in the head. Still alive. Wow. My face, you shall suffer. Yowza. <laughs> well, I was gonna say, I'm just using these guys as like little lemming, not lemmings, Pikmin following me around. But then he had to go rudely and just kill his little mad scientist friends and oh my gosh, please just die. Wow. <laughs> Somehow he managed to completely miss me, probably because I was laying in the prone position and I think guns are less likely to hit. Come on. Come on. Come on. Reloads the minigun. He's gonna run out of ammo before he kills me, I think. He's gotta be almost dead, right? We've done so much damage to him. Finally. Oh my gosh. Alright. Bam. 23 points. Who else is getting turns? Ah, there's a guy back there. And it looks like there's some more children back here. And they have a bunch of prisoners. Of which we are going to try to free. Yikes. Uh, we're going to go up here, then we're going to go to our inventory. Shoot, we ran out of action points. We're going to stim up until we can be... Healed all the way, I guess. Because we can. It's magic. Whoa. It's magic. Oh, that was not a good idea to hit me. Take some more steps forward. And right in the head. How much damage do we do? Twelve. So weak. I feel like we used to be one-shotting people. Praying super mutant, apparently. What if it's like a praying mantis? But, you know, as a super mutant. So he just stands in a weird position. He's not actually, like, praying to anything. <sighs> 14 points. He was on the ground. We could have just smashed his head in with our sledge. But instead, we decided to do very little damage to him. Let's go for the eyes. We had to be able to hit him at least once in a while, right? 102 damage, and he's still up and walking. He's probably had like 300 damage done to him. Oh, we got him. Oh well. Who's this guy? Who's this guy think he is coming up here and just shooting away at us? Let's see if we can hit him with this. Nope, out of range. So we have to take a point. Well, let's try to get two attacks in. Ah, we missed. There's something. He is also a praying super mutant. He reloaded his minigun and is coming at me. Uh, let's go for the head. Do some more brain damage. Seems to be he's stuck in the, the doorway with me. 78 points of damage, not too bad. And we missed, of course. He used two stim packs and then punched me. What a jerk. Wasting all my time and using valuable stim packs that I could have looted off of his dead body. Doesn't he know that's what I want? Uh, 11 damage. He's in two more stim packs. Come on, guy, how many are you carrying? Can't be carrying that many, right? Can't be carrying like 57 like I was earlier or whatever. Uh, 
Go for the head again. Our accuracy went up for some reason. Or maybe his dodging went down. More stem packs. Goodness. Maybe he's, um, what's his name? Babe Ruth is just tired. Because he's been doing a lot of swinging with this giant hammer. So maybe that's why he's losing damage, or losing points of health. Is because he's, um, exhausted. And that's why he's not doing as much damage. And we killed him. Okay. We're going to end the combat. We leveled up. Cool. Jeez. Apparently 170% is not high enough. Alright. Um... We're going to up our lock picking a little bit, because that seems to be a problem. And then we're going to up our melee, because... Oh, we have eye damage. Okay. So, let's go into our inventory and use a doctor's bag. Maybe. Maybe not. Use on yourself. Eh? Failed to do any healing. But we did gain some experience. And... Heal five points. Are we still blind? Or eye damaged? No, okay. Maybe I didn't have eye damage? Was that just my imagination? Pfft. I have no idea. Um. Oh well. Let's. Let's do first aid then. Let's see if we still have that. Uh, radio. And if we can still. Do we not have the radio anymore? There it is. If we can still use it to shut off these systems. I doubt we can. There's only static on the radio. Okay. Yeah, so we don't have the computer still set up. Or we don't have the computer for this place. I guess it's probably out of range. So let's see. Um, let's see if we can repair. Was the skill we used? Repair on this. Cannot repair that. Okay, let's see if we can talk to this guy. You cannot get there. What is this? This is a terminal for all those. Hey, we're free, we're free, they're dead. Sorry. What happened? Did they have, like, exploding neck collars? Dang it. Shoot. I wonder if there's anything I could do to help them escape and not explode to death. Ah, well. Maybe these guys will have a better fate. <laughs> Hello? Uh, you see Gideon, a normal-looking human. He's wearing a crown. Aw. Jason is a living god. Only the nullified may pass. Who's Jason? Jason? Who's Jason? Ah, <laughs> uh, yeah. Are you the experiments I'm looking for? The walls also have mines. I saw you tomorrow? Great. How do I join? Cannot kill the genius of the all... You F. I don't want to kill. I want to worship. I will anoint you. I must give what I must not. Anoint? Anoint me with what? Oh, he just... Uh, convincing you, Psyker, to give you a nullifier. What's a nullifier? Is this something in my inventory? Let's see if there's anything in here. Oh, psychic nullifier. Okay. Well... <laughs> that's probably how we were supposed to... Help those guys out. It does nothing. There's no place like home, no place like home, no place like home, pacing back and forth. What is this place? Isn't this your home? My home is, uh, yeah, here. Yeah, it's here. This is my home. She jumps up and down. I'm so happy. You can't believe how happy this makes me. I think I'm going to go punch the wall for a while. Oh. That's, uh, unfortunate. The asphalt show. Uh, yeah, goodbye. I don't even want to know. What is this psychic nullifier for? Can we use it on this guy? This is nothing. Okay. Can't even talk to these guys. Did my game crash? No. Just can't talk to them. <sighs> Spodium is normal except for the children of the cathedral symbol engaved, engraved in front of it. Okay. Are we done here? There's a footlocker and a locker in here. Maybe we should go unlock those. <laughs> I wonder what this psychic nullifier was for. You were unable to pick the lock? Of course. So we're going to have to try it like 8 million times. There we go. Got it. Two times. Ooh, 2,000 caps for no reason. Now we're going to have to loot three times to pick them all up. We have 20,000 caps. We're rolling in the dough. 
Oh, it's locked. Everything's locked in this place. Who are they not trusting? Oh, I already picked it. Some Nuka Cola and some combat armor. Nah, I don't care. Um, and of course, <laughs> this is also locked. Alright, just some bombs in here. No point. Okay, let's go back to the elevator. And we're gonna go down to the next. Actually, we're not. I need to loot these guys. Ugh. So much ammo. Just need to make sure they don't have anything that I actually need on them. Like a key, or a flying carpet, or a magic missile. Magic missile? Is that a spell? A magic missile spell. Do any of these guys have anything on them? Gosh, I just feel so bad. They're all dead now. Oh well. They smelled freedom, and the smell was too great, so their heads exploded. Back to the elevator. Down to floor three. Immediately when we get off, we're gonna save it. Because that was a big tussle. And holy cow, look at all this stuff. It's so gross in here. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. At least nine. Uh yeah, at least nine of those guys in there. And then we've got some robots in here. There's a guy there too. Oh my gosh. So many people everywhere. And this guy's gonna come in here and this is gonna be awkward. An intruder! And probably all the robots are gonna wake up now anyways. 20 points. At least I opened the chest, right? Alright, let's get over here. And knock some sense into this guy's head. These don't seem to be the super strong... His name was Vis Viscous. Right? Is it Viscous or Vicious? I can't see it. Oh well, we'll just call him Viscous. Even though it's probably Vicious. Oh, shoot. They're coming for me. How do they expect to get to me? Are they gonna just ro walk straight through the wall? I don't know, but it seems like they're, uh... Ah, there we go. They were all turning at that point to get in there, but it seems like they're ready to rumble. We're just gonna silently loot as we're waiting for them. Just kidding, we're gonna hide here. And try to funnel them through the door. Hopefully no more super mutants can actually get in this room. Ah, oh, did he shoot his friend? Yeah! That's what I like to see. No, don't shoot me. Shoot your friends! Ah, the shoot. They can walk through each other. You have to hit him in the head. Dang it. I just need somebody to die. Cause this is getting way too packed in here. There's two down, it looks like. Nope, just one down. Super Mutant uses a stim pack. Oh, come on! Are all alone.